scroll down the list of color changes. There are now 18, but many of them are the same colors repeated. Click Change Order of Color Blocks. The Color Order dialog box appears. If needed, click and drag the bottom right corner of the box to see all the color blocks. Use Change Order of Color Blocks when changing the order of designs with multiple areas of cutwork and stabilizing lines. Color Sort may occasionally merge stabilizing lines in these circumstances. Click the green color block in position 4. Click the Move Up button twice. Green block number 4 is now below green block number 1. Move the green color blocks number 7 and 10, in turn, to just below block number 4. This places the stabilizing lines for the four wings together at the top of the embroidery. Click the red color block in position 5. Click the Move Up button once. Red block number 5 is now below red block number 2. Move the red blocks, numbers 8 and 11, in turn, to just below block number 5. Click the green color block in position 1. The two color blocks below the Merge Colors button are the same green. Click Merge Colors three times. There is now one green block at the top. Do not move the green color block in position 13. This is for the outlines of the wings and is stitched after the cutwork is placed. Click the red color block in position 2. Click Merge Colors three times. There is now one red color block. Click the yellow color block in position 3 and merge the four yellow color blocks. Click OK to close the Color Order dialog box. There are now nine colors in the color worksheet.